rear bumper. And we got the front bumper right here. The Ferrari is out of commission. Look, it has no like gears no more. There's our savior, bro. The last time you guys are gonna be seeing the front bumper right here. So today we're gonna be picking up a kit for the 350Z. So just stay tuned. We got a three hour drive, for maybe four hour drive ahead of us. So let's get going. Made it to the destination, ED, erectile dysfunction. <laughs> yes, we made it to this, the destination, ED. We're gonna get off and see if we can get these bumpers, bro. Rear bumper, and we got the front bumper right here. And we're not gonna show you guys exactly what bumper till we get home. All right, we're gonna load these things up. All right, that's cool. We're loading them up in the Ferrari. We call it the Ferrari. <laughs> this thing busts some fat missions. Let's head out. Once we get home, we will install one, if not both, of the bumpers. You guys got to wait and see. But let me know right now which bumper you guys want us to do first. We'll flip a coin when I get home. I kind of want to do the front bumper. What about you? I kind of want the other. The front bumper. Yeah. <laughs> so let us know what you guys want to do first. You guys want the rear bumper or the front bumper? Let us know down in the comments down below. Unfortunately, the Rari or the Ferrari is out of commission. This thing just broke down on us on the in the middle of the freeway, bro. Not even halfway home. We're close to being halfway home. No. We're barely about to get on the grapevine. We're barely gonna get to the grapevine and this thing took a shit on us. I don't know how I'm gonna get it home. That's the worst part about it. And let me show you guys this. Let me see more. Let me show you guys real quick. And we left this whole trail of oil. We had a fat, fat cloud of smoke behind us. Check that out. Yeah, I have no idea what we're gonna do, bro. Because we needed the, the VQ sensor. These are gonna be the NRG seats that we're gonna be putting in. You guys know NRG is one of my big sponsors. Watching this. <laughs> results and things like this We're waiting for some chick-fil-a right now because we need a grub bro we haven't ate all day i'm super starving i'm super tired i'm gonna take a nap as soon as that after i eat i'm gonna take a nap we're waiting on my brother to come with the truck and the dolly so we can get out of here we stopped at the spot right here it's a, like a little um gym and uh, we stop right here it's out of the way of all the traffic we don't have to worry about anyone hitting us or anything like that it's easier for him to get in here and just load up the van and we can get the fuck out of here. You wish you would have stayed in school? No. <laughs> you rather be over here? Yeah. <laughs> I'd rather be walking in the heat. This sucks. So, let's wait for our Chick-fil-A. Thank you. No way. <laughs> yes, sir. We got our Chick-fil-A. Let's grub so we can take a nap. You need to get some fucking ketchup on it. No, I don't like your soup. I just use the sauce. <laughs> I think there should be ketchup in there. Psych! <laughs> Let me make sure she didn't put no pickles. Yes, sir. We got stupid, stupid, stupid luck. Because I got it into the parking spot the way I needed to get it into. Look, it has no like gears no more. I think I broke a gear, or I broke the gears or something. I don't know what it could have been, or I broke, I don't know. But this thing is like, oh my God. I don't know how we're gonna get it onto the trailer, but we're gonna have to figure something out. We're gonna have to maybe force the trailer on or something. I don't know what. Auxilio! Ayuda! <laughs> Help! <laughs> With the voice. <laughs> 
Look what the cat drug in. A little GTR action. Yes, sir. His first time seeing one in person. He's all wet. <laughs> They're clean, huh? Yeah, I should tell it to you. There's still hella smells in here. Let's try this thing again, bro. Maybe she chilled out and maybe she'll be working. I don't think so because that light's still on. Yeah, nope. Nope. Bye, 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 bye. Bye, bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs> Damn, that sucks, bro. There's our savior, bro. There's our savior. All right, so we managed to get these wheels in neutral. We just pulled off this casing that goes for the, um, I guess, drive shaft, I guess you could say for this. And um, it was pretty broken, but you guys can see that shit hanging right there. So all we did was basically act like we were putting it in uh, neutral. He pressed the brake and I uh, yanked, or I used the screwdriver to pull on the little lever right up in here that little lever and we got it into neutral so now the wheels are spinning freely and we can get the dolly on we we're having issues with the truck as well thing was overheating was all the power. <laughs> this day is not going in our favor bro no, at all but we're gonna try to get it on right now and hopefully we can get the fuck out of here I got a dime here. Get this bumper removed. That's the last time you guys are gonna be seeing the front bumper right here. All right, so are you guys ready for this, bro? I'm super excited to show you guys which bumper I went with. I'm not super excited on all the work that I'm gonna have to do to it to make it perfect for either paint or wrap, like I mentioned. And I kind of do want to learn how to wrap myself. So we might be wrapping the whole entire car in the future. Let's get moving. Let's go. The Zeta Duraflex bumper. It's basically like a Nismo bumper. And I'm super, super excited to throw that thing on the Z. I can't wait to see what it looks like with paint and everything completely done. But you guys are going to have to stay tuned for that. All right, if you guys are excited to see what this thing looks like on the car, hit the like button. All right, so we're fitting. Almer came and hooked hook me up. Um, we came to fit the bumper real quick. As you guys can see right here, it's super, super white because we went ahead and cut some of the fiberglass out right up in here as you guys could tell it's cut right up along this line and it was hitting on this um, little i think that's like an oil cooler i'm not exactly sure what the heck that is but yeah we had a cut right there it's not the prettiest not the best looking but who's gonna look in there like so deep like from back here it still looks good you know and then if we paint it or wrap it it's gonna look a lot better we just got to align these uh, holes right here. We got a little bit more work to do, maybe a little tiny bit more cutting. And um, also we had to use this flap disc because I didn't have a cutter or a grinder or a grinder cutter, cutting wheel. But for the most part, as you guys can see right here, the bumper is like fitting super, super good, super, super flush. And it looks, come back here, Armour. It looks mean, bro. Huh? It looks super good. So if you guys are lucky, we might be doing the rear bumper today. I'm not exactly sure, but we still got to drill some of the holes out for the bumper to stay. So we have the ones along here and then the two that go one right here, one on the other side. But how does it look so far? <laughs> it looks cool. Yeah. All right. So let's get to finishing this up. We'll drill those holes. And uh, did I say hose? Did I say, I meant holes, not hose. <laughs> we don't want no hose. <laughs> they ain't loyal. This has been around for probably like, 20 years bro i swear i kid you not but it wasn't mine um i don't know where i came up on it but i came up and uh look it i'm scared 
We're just trying to make it work while we can. We'll make bigger holes right now. I'm just trying to get everything kind of like adjusted, kind of lined up right now. We'll make all the rest of the holes or bigger holes in just a minute. But let's kind of get it finished lined up. We got two more holes to drill out and uh, we'll be good to go. Then we can tighten it up. We can put the hood down, see what it looks like. Or should we do that now? Mm, you want to try right now? Let's try right now. Hold this. Ready? Let's try this out. How's it look? Look mean or not? Yeah. Yeah? Yup, yes sir. This thing is gonna look so good once it's like wrapped or painted and um, a little bit lower, better wheels. And then once we throw on the rear bumper as well, what do you think, should we do it today? Should we give them more of a treat today or should we wait for tomorrow or for the next video? Next video? We're gonna find out, we're gonna try to finish this up. If we have enough time, we'll do it today. If not, you guys are gonna have to wait till the next video. Mm -hmm.